why is my tile so slippery? Two key reasons for that. Uh, the texture or the surface characteristics of the tile and then secondly whether there's any contaminants on the tile. The, if a tile is very smooth, uh, uh, very shiny, there's nothing there really to grip your foot or the tire so you can slide very easily. Obviously if there's contaminants on the floor like water, food contaminants, grease, oil uh, or uh, dust and things like that again they can get under your foot or under the tread of a tire and cause you to slip. So there are two main ways. Uh, slipperiness can also depend on the type of footwear, uh, the slope or inclination of the walkway, um, the way you walk, your physical fitness. There's all other factors but these two key uh, ones are the texture uh, or surface characteristics of the floor and the contaminants. If you can if we could control those, we can minimize slipperiness significantly. Surface Grip Treat is a chemical treatment that we can apply to a hard surface or walkway surface to increase the slip resistance of that surface. It's a safe and effective way of meeting national safety standards and it's a long lasting treatment with minimal maintenance. Um, it will chemically modify the surface at a microscopic level and increase the depth of the pores on that surface so that when water or contaminants get onto the surface they have somewhere to go and they'll grip your feet or the tire rather than creating aquaplaning or slipping across that surface. How do we install surface grip treat? Uh, installing surface grip treat is a three-step process we need to clean the floor, we need to treat the floor, and then we need to neutralize it. Before we do anything, we do a little test off to the side to make sure everything's compatible. Assuming we're happy with that, then we clean the surface using our surface clean. Uh, that is mopped on or used a pump up sprayer. Clean the surface, let it dry, then you apply the grip treat. Uh, that needs to be applied using a pump up sprayer or a lambswool applicator. That's applied for eight to 10 minutes. It's important that it doesn't dry out. So periodically you can add some more material or agitate it so that the uh, surface doesn't dry out. After the eight to 10 minutes, then you want to neutralize it. We neutralize again using the surface clean product that's mopped on or sprayed on in a similar manner. That'll immediately neutralize the surface. Then you can rinse it off and uh, then you can put it back into use. It's a very quick and effective way of treating the surface. So what is the ongoing maintenance with the uh, surface grip treat uh, system? Well, it's very easy to maintain and it's a long lasting treatment. As long as the pores that we've deepened and modified with our treatment don't get clogged up, uh, it will remain effective. So we want to use cleaners that will clean out any oils or dirt uh, any kind of uh, fat or grease that may get into the surface and clog up those pores. We recommend using our emerald. That's a microbial cleaner, very effective, uh, very uh, cost effective. You only use one or two ounces per gallon of water and uh, it will leave the surface without a residue. Can we use surface grip treat on glossy tiles? You need to be careful of using the surface grip treat on glossy tiles. It will reduce the sheen. Uh, it has a low pH and that can uh, reduce the sheen of glossy tiles. So if that's important to you, we recommend that you would use one of our other products like the uh, Glaze Guard Plus or our Tile Slip Shield. Surface grip treat is very effective on non-glossy tiles, on exterior tile, stone and concrete where the glossiness may not be of such an issue. What type of surface can I use surface grip treat on? It has to be a mineral based surface, something like concrete, tile, porcelain tile, ceramic tile, natural stone or terrazzo. It won't work on non-mineral surfaces, so it's not going to work on metal, it's not going to work on wood for example. It has to be a mineral surface that we can chemically react with, modify at a microscopic level, 
the surface and increase the friction and uh, surface coefficient. Can I use surface grip treat interior or exterior? The answer is yes, it works very well interior and exterior. We definitely like to promote it for exterior use because it works very well where there's a lot of potential for the floor to get wet. So commercial areas like driveways, pickup areas, service areas works extremely well. Uh, residential could be a pool deck, your driveway, or interior, things like kitchens and shower rooms. The surface grip treat is very effective. How can I make my epoxy floor less slippery? Well, you can't actually use the surface grip treat for uh, epoxy floors. It has to be a mineral-based surface. Uh, but we can use our Glaze Guard Plus, which bond, bonds very well to the uh, epoxy, or our uh, Tile Slip Shield. Uh, either one of those products bonds well. The Glaze Guard Plus is for a heavy-duty application, and the uh, Tile Slip Shield is more for uh, medium to low-duty application. How do I make tiles in a shower less slippery? Well, the Surface Grip Treat is a very effective way of doing that. That's a three-step process where you clean the tile, you treat it with a surface grip treat, and then you neutralize it with the uh, surface clean. It's very uh, fast, takes about 45 minutes, and what it will do, it will modify microscopically the surface of the tile so that instead of you aquaplaning or sliding on the surface, it will create a more, much more of a suction effect. And it's very easy to maintain you just maintain it by keeping it clean uh, using something like an emerald cleaner or a good uh, degreaser.